Hello and Good Day, presenting Motivational and Inspirational Quotes by my favorite pastor in the world, Joel Osteen. Here are now 10 more quotes 301 through 310. Let's get started with number 301. What would have happened to me if I would not have believed I would see the goodness of God? 302. Instead of considering how big your obstacle is, why don't you start considering how big your God is? He spoke worlds into existence. He flung stars into space. He can make things happen that you could never make happen. 303. It's vital that you accept yourself and learn to be happy with who God made you to be. If you want to truly enjoy your life, you must be at peace with yourself. 304. Quit worrying about those trying to hold you back. God knows how to move the wrong people out of your life and bring the right people in. 305. May 31st the power of your words death and life are in the power of the tongue, and those who love it will eat its fruit. Proverbs 18 verse 21 NASP our words have tremendous power and are similar to seeds. By speaking them aloud, they are planted in our subconscious minds, take root, grow, and produce fruit of the same kind. Whether we speak positive or negative words, we will reap exactly what we sow, that's why we need to be extremely careful what we think and say. The Bible compares the tongue to the small rudder of a huge ship, which controls the ship's direction, see James 3 verse 4. Similarly, your tongue will control the direction of your life. You create an environment for either good or evil with your words, and if you're always murmuring, complaining, and talking about how bad life is treating you, you're going to live in a pretty miserable world. Use your words to change your negative situations and fill them with life. 306. Live in harmony with one another. Be sympathetic, love as brothers, be compassionate and humble. 1 Peter 3 colon 8 inch. 307. You are not limited by your education, by how you were raised, by that environment. God has destined you to rise higher. He's destined you to go to the next level. 308. If you hold on to what you want so tightly, it almost becomes an idol. 309. When you do the right thing when the wrong thing is happening, you're getting stronger, your roots are going down deeper. That's why God doesn't remove everything instantly. If you're always comfortable, you won't be prepared. We grow in difficult times. 310. You may have people coming against you, trying to discredit you, make you look bad. You don't have to fight that battle, just outlast them. Just keep doing the right thing. Keep being faithful each day and God will take care of who's trying to stop you.